Hi hey folks, welcome back to the channel. Welcome if you haven't been before. My name's Watto and I wander about. That's Kim, say hello Kim. Hello Kim. Hello Kim. Uh, we're doing something a little bit different, just a very short little wander around St Petrox Church in Padstow. Um, just because it's a very nice bit of architecture and it's got a good bit of history about it. So we'll give you a little look. Really nice construction. Another nail door there. Oh, it's a lovely little church. It's why we like to come and visit these places. Not religious, but the architecture always fascinates me. So we like to come and have a little look. At this particular church in Padstow, St. Petrock, Mostly 13th and 14th century. Really interesting bit of architecture on it. Very nice. You see the age in that door there for sure, can't you? Lovely graveyard. <laughs> it's quite atmospheric at the moment with the crows in the background. Nice big tower there. So this church, I've just read there, lies on the Saints Way. It's obviously a pilgrimage way. And they've got a really nice lich gate here on the way in, look. Very nice. Some really ornate headstones. Looks like some stained glass windows there. Not sure if you can get inside and have a look, but we're going to see if we can in a second. Try and go in through this door, which is the south door. The font dates from the 15th century and is made of cataclous stone. Another carvings in it, look at that. Bit of workmanship gone into there. Nice example of the organ. Apparently this pulpit dates from around about 1530. And again, a craftsmanship in it. It's very nice. Here's a view of the organ from where the organist sits. I'll see round to the main altar. Really nice windows. monument on the wall there to uh, some of the members of the Pridu family, closely associated with Padstow. Yeah, it'll walk up the graveyard, then we come back outside. Very nice inside there. It's 
Lots of Celtic crosses as you'd expect. At the moment, we've got a nice sunny day today, so it's a, a bit of a treat, really. Very nice, very peaceful. Just away from the crowds at the moment. The plant growing through that tomb there, look. It's forcing it apart at the top. Take much more for that to come down. So a little walk down this bit. You look at some of the these old graves and headstones. Some proper age to them. And that's a nice shot of the church itself there. It's very nice that. Unusual to see those stones all together there. Let's go and have a look. Yeah, so this looks like a family grave. They're all Hutchings. William, Robert, I can't really read the other names, Sarah on the end there. It almost looks like a fireplace, that it might well be if somebody knows, who knows more about religious buildings, please let me know. From what I can make out, judging by the layout inside the church, that steps and that door there is access to the uh, to the bell tower oh, i'm quite intrigued as to what that is unless that's where there would have been a fire to maybe provide heat in for the church maybe i'm not sure one of you will tell me surely A lovely old clock there as well on the tower, really nice. Well, we enjoyed that little short walk around the church there. Just thought it was worth having a little look at while we're down this way. Like a bit of historic architecture, eh? Lovely. No doubt Kim's got some nice photos, I should think. So if you have liked it, just give us a thumbs up. Consider subscribing to the channel. And we'll see you on the next one. Say goodbye, Kim. Goodbye, Kim. Bye, Kim. Bye, Kim.